second John of the 12th chapter, verses 23 through 32. Second John 3, 14 says, And as Moses lifted up the serpent in the wilderness, even so must the Son of Man be lifted up. Turn with me, if you will, to John the 12th chapter. The 23rd, I mean, 23rd, 24th, 27 through the 37th verse. And the Bible says, and Jesus answered them, saying, The hour is come that the Son of Man should be glorified. Very, very, I say unto you, except the corn of wheat fall into the ground and die, it abideth alone. But if it die, it bringeth forth much fruit. Verse number 27 says, Now is my soul troubled. And what shall I say? Father, save me from this hour. Uh, but for this cause came I into this hour. Father, glorify thy name. Then came there a voice from heaven saying, I have both glorified it and will glorify it again. The people therefore that stood by and heard it said that it thundered. Others said an angel spake to him. And Jesus answered and said, This voice came not because of me, but for your sake. Now is the judgment of this world. Now shall the prince of this world be cast out. And I, oh, if I be lifted up from the earth, will draw all men unto me. Yes, yes. One preaching from the subject, he must be lifted. Right. One tell somebody, he, he must, must be lifted. Yes. Certainly, certainly. God bless uh, Mother Trustee Sylvia Long. We've been, we've been hanging out quite a bit lately. Uh, you want to get an early sea on Southwest? <laughs> yeah, she rides the wheelchair too, yeah. <laughs> Coming home, she'll use the wheelchair. <laughs> <laughs> and, and we, had, we had fun together in the middle of at one time. You know. But he must be lifted. Certainly, it goes without saying that the he that we're making reference to is a subject that has to be Jesus. Because he alone deserves all the glory. And he alone deserves the honor. And he alone deserves the praise. He won't even share his glory with another. No, no, no. That's why we have to be so careful in the church. And we don't get off into areas where we don't belong. Say it again. Because glory exclusively belongs to Him. Yes, yes, yes. He alone is worthy of all the glory, the honor, and the praise. It's His. It's His. It's His glory. Amen. All over the world today, believers, believers are celebrating the crowd. Celebrating the death price that our Lord paid for sin. But I'm glad that I'm in the full knowledge of the gospel because I don't serve a dead Savior. No, no, no. And even as we reflect, much of our reflection is symbolic because we don't worship a dead Savior. Because we know that 